Here we go. <laughs> Hi, Floss Tube. I'm Barb. And I'm Leanne. And this is Lost, Lost in Floss. Floss. Oh, man. I am recovered from StitchCon. How about you, Barb? I am recovered, and I'd like to say I was never sick. Barb wasn't sick. <laughs> spreading false rumors. I, I was just, you know, I I just kind of meant lightly that you were just recovering from StitchCon and uh, <laughs> I was back to work at seven the next day. So oh, man. It was, it was a quick turnaround. Yeah, and I just made that video by myself. Well, I went up no. into the craft room and I'm like, okay, I'm going to talk. <laughs> I'm like, oh, there oh, she is. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> no, was Which was really weird weird to do so you girls that and guys that do it singly that's hard <laughs> so I there's can't, nobody I can't to feed imagine. off of yeah I, I would have a hard time with that so bar yes stitch con it was it was fun <laughs> it was well an inspirational like uh, i feel like a beginning stitcher now when i see what talent there was it, on that break table alone. oh my gosh holy cow it was amazing oh. and i'm sure you've seen videos people yeah. have, have been having them um yeah a and you're just like oh i'd stitch that i'd stitch that i'd stitch that i'd stitch that mm -hmm. you know it would take me 20 years to stitch it but right. i'd stitch that well, so yeah it was fun it was the first road trip we've been on together in how many years in a long time. I, I felt like we got along as roommates I think, oh, yeah, I think so. And and really on our way home, for about 15 minutes, Barb ran out of something to say. Um, but it was only about 15, well, maybe 12. And and then the conversation kept going. As it always does. And it, it was hard going home because we were tired. Yeah. I mean, we stayed up. We enveloped StitchCon to the fullest, mm -hmm. I think. Yep. Well, and... Going there, I went in on like the night or two before, little little sleep. So that was not, that was not a positive. But and it took us longer to get. You know, we thought it would take about six hours. and a half hours to get there. It took us nine. Yeah, it was close How to. How long my... did it take us to get home? Yeah, over nine. Yeah, it was. A long trip. Well, and on the way there, it went faster because I was tying tying the cookies. Yeah. <laughs> We we ended up making 400 cookies between the two of us and so that we could set it at the table of every by every stitcher um we thought if we're going to do something we're going to do something for everyone and that's kind of mm -hmm. was our little treat for everyone since so Barb always bakes and things yeah. like that and I'm like, "Well, I can make cookies too." So <laughs> yeah, so So we did. It was fun. And I'll insert a picture here. But we have a previous video that you might have seen us pan along all the cookies that that we had. Mm -hmm. But Barb was tying on the tags, which it took forever. Was way harder than making the cookies. I think. Yeah. <laughs> it well, you know, the fact that I did it for six hours, <laughs> and we still—that's what we had to stay up and finish them. Yeah. Although we could have done it the next night, but we, we just wanted to get it done. We and stayed up the first, the Wednesday that we got there. We stayed up till yeah. three. And then, you know, of course, <laughs> the frugal nature. Um, like, we had to get up in time for free breakfast. Oh, yeah. So, Which, I mean, it uh, wasn't like we were ever sleeping in. No, no. None. Never like till 10 o'clock or anything. It was no. seven ish, six ish. Yeah, so. Something um, like that. Thank so. goodness I can function pretty well on a little sleep. I just get a little punchy. I found out I can too. Mm -hmm. And yeah. driving home, your punchiness <laughs> help, get, keep help you us awake. get home. Yeah. <laughs> I taught Leanne my trick of um, getting up when you're really tired. <laughs> it doesn't work. <laughs> what yeah. is it now again, Barb? <laughs> Come on. I cannot I cannot remember that phrase for some Give reason. Give it your best guess. Oh, I know you you said it just before we videotaped too. Mm -hmm. And it's oh man. I think I've I've said this before in a video. I think and I know this is not it. It's like let's go. <laughs> well, the intonation's good. <laughs> yeah. But it's actually here we go. Oh, here we go. <laughs> and I and I keep forgetting that. Yeah. 
<laughs> Here we go. <laughs> it doesn't work. It works for me. But Sometimes yeah. I just have to say it in my head, though. I don't want to wake oh. up, Jim. Not too loud. Uh, yeah. No, it's... but it was um, it was fun. It was great to meet people that um, several we've kind of been in contact with before, and it was just like you knew them forever. It was it was funny. Like yeah. I didn't expect it to feel that natural, but it was just like oh, you know, like here we are. Valerie from Stitching in the mm -hmm. Barn. Um, we kind of we kind of comment on each other's videos mm -hmm. but nothing really like overly no talkative or anything but it just felt like and kathy to die house kathy to die house same, same thing, thing. <laughs> it felt like you knew them forever and that was kind of a it, it was just weird it you was know? just because you it, it wasn't like you were getting used to like anything about them no it kind of felt no and they are exactly like they are on their video yeah you know just very nice very fun yep. smiling just Happy just the people. same yeah. yeah yeah so that was great and I, and I have to say that was true of almost all the mm -hmm. floss tours oh, yeah. that we met I can think of one that you thought I, I thought was no <laughs> no not snotty <laughs> but just a little different than what I had <laughs> imagined them to be oh okay nobody was snotty was <laughs> I'm not gonna... I, I i i wrote down i could think of one i don't know who it was <laughs> she knows i know we're gonna find out <laughs> you never will <laughs> oh, sorry oh man no, but every all the floss tubes no, they were, were exactly like they are in very um, nice. their floss tubes, which very fun. is really nice. Yeah. And yeah, just just a lot of very welcoming people. And and to you know, I don't I had never thought that other floss tubers watched us. But they do. Like I knew Kathy and Valerie did. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Cuz they would comment, but I didn't know other people did. Oh, and and like, you know, yeah, people are just fun. Mm -hmm. Jan Hicks, the night we spent laughing in the hotel. Oh, uh, oh in the lobby. Lobby. And all the s'mores girls. Oh, yeah. Which I wrote down. <laughs> it's Chris, Suzanne, Marion, Susan slash Carol. Slash Sharon. Superstar. <laughs> <laughs> she, she knows who she is. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, Jan Hicks and Joanne, Joanne too. Oh, God, she was funny. Yeah. She was Jan Hicks' roommate. Yeah. So that was really fun. We, we that, were... We were done stitching, and we were going to go and stitch with somebody else in our hotel lobby, which we didn't know anybody was doing that. Yeah. And we kind of were walking, and all of a sudden, Chris goes, would you like some s'mores? And we're like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I never had that in a hotel before. I never did. I never knew delicious. that you could make microwave s'mores, but now I do have the ingredients I'm going to Oh, did you bring them? <laughs> no, I didn't. I'm sorry. I should have. But, um, but yeah, it was really fun talking to those yeah, ladies. Yeah, that was, we laughed and oh. laughed and laughed. Yeah, <laughs> so. really hard. Uh, it was great. And that's kind of how everybody was. Mm -hmm. It's yeah. really like, oh, come on, join us. Come on, do this. Mm -hmm. Come on, do that. And, you know, shopping in the annex or in the at keepsakes, you would just strike up a conversation with somebody. Mm -hmm. And, you know, you spoke the same language. Right, right. There's so many, you know, people that were fun that it's hard to list them all just because... I have everybody written down here, but not everybody, <laughs> so... This is the one person she didn't like. There are no notes on that one, <laughs> so... Why did you say it? Well... Because. Well, I, I would just say almost everybody was... <laughs> Can we make Leanne blush? <laughs> I'm going to cut this out. What if I say Fabio? <laughs> Fabio. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, I don't know why. That is not like my dream man. <laughs> Believe me, me, it's not. <laughs> so, um, oh, one thing I wanted to mention is we talked to Beth, who is a viewer. Oh, yeah. And we wanted to say hi to Tina. Hi, Tina. Who is not a stitcher, but watches <laughs> us. So, hi, Tina. So we give you credit. Yeah. I don't know why you're watching us, but 
That's so nice. It was Thank nice you for to, doing it. Nice to hear that you enjoy our videos. Yeah. So hopefully now she's like, oh, they said hi to me. Well, it's, it's you. Yeah. <laughs> we were trying to find out when your birthday was, but I guess we just missed it. So a little oh, really? while ago. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. So oh, that okay. went to work. No. Hmm. So um, do we want to mention all these people or how do we want to do this? Or as we're walking. Yeah, as we're talking. Um, but really, a special thank you to the people who were in charge of putting it on. Um, Absolutely. Barbara was just, like, phenomenal. She's, like, buzzing around there. And they were so organized. And Barb and I have done things uh -huh. where we had, like, a big project like that that we did together. We know how difficult it is. They made it look seamless uh -huh. and effortless. Yep. Um, very organized. I... And I love how they got, you know, husbands, boyfriends, kids, friends, you know, like everyone just rallied around just their effort. Just kind of help. Effort. Yeah. And I'm going to say next year, I'm gonna, I'll help. Just <laughs> call me. I'll help. Plus, I'll still pay to Wait, come. she's going to have to get her bus driver license. <laughs> no, I'm not driving the bus. Even with air? <laughs> no, I'm not driving the bus. <laughs> Yeah, we, we even got a kick out of, it was a Brandon, um, Barbara's son. Yeah. <laughs> he was fun to kid around with. Yeah, he was. <laughs> so, yeah, we had fun. Yeah. Yeah. Great, great team, Barbara. Mm-hmm. So. And then, Barb, how did you like keepsakes oh, slash treasures? Yeah, I, <laughs> I don't think I called it treasures at all, did no, I? No, you did not. Yeah, it was awesome. I mean... Everything I expected, and then some more. Mm -hmm. I mean, just, I could have spent, like, probably a couple of days in there, really. I yeah. I felt like, you know, not necessarily rushed, but I could have spent much longer in there. Just like... Oh, yeah. Because people have shown things, and it. it's like, well, I didn't see that. <laughs> Where was that hiding? And just even, like, picking out fabrics, you know... I got some beautiful things, but I didn't get to look through every bin. <laughs> and Barbara's That's husband, John, was doing the cutting of the fabric. And, I mean, you asked him, kind of told him what kind of color you wanted. He's, like, looking and digging. I mean, he was fast, efficient, and got the job done. Um, I think, was it Sharon upstairs that was helping with floss? Oh. Yeah, I can't remember her name, but she was really she good. She was too. really good, and I bought some floss on her recommendation. Me too, and yeah. So it was fun, you know, again, and Jen Spoonerooney, she <laughs> was so funny. I mean, I really, everybody that worked there was really nice. Yeah. And you did not realize, like, 400 people are kind of shopping throughout the whole right. day, and you did not feel at all like they were rushed. They took their time with mm -hmm. you. We're always like asking if you could help. Yeah. They could help find something for you. Which, Smiling. Yeah, it was great. We yeah. we did go twice. Um, mm -hmm. The first time was the first day, and we were only there. We Is that when we went out to lunch? We went out to lunch late, and then we were going there. We realized that it was only open for half an hour. Um we were there at 4.30, it closed at 5. Mm -hmm. But when we got there, the last bus was leaving, the mm -hmm. last stitchy was... bus. So we pretty much had the place to ourselves mm -hmm. when we were in there, which was really nice. And it didn't feel like they were rushing us no. out the door. Mm -hmm. So No, um. we decided we were just going to look on the bottom floor. Just in, And it takes a while to get acclimated mm -hmm. and everything to it. But we thought, well, we'll just do the bottom floor since we have a short right. period of time. Right. So. Yeah, we had gone. We had a table. We had actually two table mates, Pat and mm -hmm. Sarah. Mm -hmm. And Pat came with us to yeah, lunch. Yeah, she came to lunch with us, so. and then we went to keepsakes. Yeah, that was fun. Yeah, it was. So, <laughs> so, <laughs> so, so, so. Yeah. Uh, um, and the fl the like, for me because I love gardening. Um, Barbara's gardens. Oh my gosh, just gorgeous. Just. It just fit the house. I mean... It did. The flowers were pretty. They were in bloom. We had great weather. It was hot, but it was sunny and 
didn't, didn't rain, rain at all. Um, the inside of keepsakes was just like the outside of keepsakes. Charming, adorable. Um, Barbara has a way of grouping things together mm -hmm. that's really pleasing to the eye and yeah. um, using objects, just kind of like Barb does, using different objects for not what they were intended. Well, you do that too. Well, I try, but you know, she's she really, really got a knack She for really, that. I mean, especially when you saw the annex, which is just, you know, basically a hotel room. Yeah. How inviting and appealing everything mm -hmm. was displayed. It was beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. So we we had fun shopping. We did. <laughs> we did. And we will show what we got. Yeah. Um Later but on. let's show some of the kindness people yeah. gifted us with. Yeah. Let's do that. If we're done with I, that part. I think yeah, because we'll go and talk about all the if at the end if I don't mm -hmm. if we haven't said somebody then Oh, and the one thing was edible, so um Cupcake Stitcher, oh my gosh. <laughs> oh yeah. We've heard so much about her <laughs> cupcakes and we And what day was that? We were leaving and then all it was of a sudden one of it was the like first days. Do you do you want a cupcake? Like, and we're like cupcake yeah. stitcher cupcake? Absolutely, yes. Yeah. And she she just talked to her, you know, here and there and she's just very, very nice. She is really sweet. Yeah. So that was fun. Yeah, it was. It's like her her legend in baking preceded her. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. So Okay, so right, here, here do we you go. want your, I'll give you mm. your pop. Oops, sorry. I'll get it. Mm. Thanks. Thank you. Excuse me, pardon us. <laughs> oh. So first of all, Valerie gave us a little gift. We met her, we were eating breakfast, and she came in and met us. Um, and she <laughs> gave us this bag. Well, we each have one. But yeah. Mine's okay. on the day. <laughs> yeah. Mine's we each have one. We have to see. share. Let me see. Oh, and I one. have to show. I do have a seam ripper exactly like the one that's in this pouch. Oh. So I do know what it's like to rip. Oh, my. That's funny. <laughs> yeah. Like, we're, I've never seen a pink one. I, I, I don't know. Yeah, oh. it's older. And I had it, and I'm like, oh, my gosh, it's just like the seam ripper I have. Yeah, that's funny. So, and then she also gave us candy, but that we both ate That it. I ate. <laughs> so I'm sorry, Valerie. But thank you. It was yeah, really was sweet of very, you. very, very sweet. And nice to think of us. Yeah. And you can go ahead. Well, this, the, do you have yours like this? I do, right here. And this is from Barbara. Nevada Stitcher, who always comments and is always oh so my sweet, gosh. and I always wondered who it was. And look at this. She made us these. I just, I couldn't even believe someone would. With this tomato would on it. Stitch. It is absolutely perfect. Yeah, I love it. And I think what I'm going to do with this, I think I'm going to put a string on the back and use it as an ornament. Oh, that's a really good idea. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because I'll, I was... I'll put it on my wool tree now because yeah. I'll be able to see it all the time and then yeah. put it on the Christmas tree. That's a afterwards. really good yeah. idea. I just because I was cool. thinking the other day, I'm like, oh, usually like I love to get an ornament from somewhere new and I'm like, well, yeah, I didn't, I mean, I don't know that there was a... I don't think there was a stitch con ornament yeah. or anything. So, but or, yeah, thank you so much, Barbara. That was yeah, just it was really, nice. really, really nice. And, and, she, and it, she was just so sweet that and to talk to that was like the first day i believe yeah um that we got them and yeah, well I, I was just like we were, we were standing in line. line yeah i was just like oh my gosh oh my god what a sweetheart yeah so, so okay what do you want to do next um then debbie with an eye oops came up to us and she is a viewer and I call her Debbie with an I because it is Debbie with an I. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and what is she? CM Debbie, I think on Instagram. She she gave us these. They are a piece of paper that you can put your project. Uh, let's see, the project and everything on it. Designer fabric threads, start and finish. And it's on this 
She let us pick the paper that yeah. we wanted. You were gone, so I picked that yeah, for I you. Yeah, I like this. And then she put it on a ring with floss. I think it. that's such a good idea. I think it really is a good idea because a lot of times, especially if you do floss tubes and you're pulling out your stuff to show and then you want to put it back in the in the in your bag and you're like, "Uh-oh, what was in this bag?" Yeah. and the floss is there. Right. So, it's I thought true. it was an excellent excellent idea. Thank you, Debbie. And she also gifted us Oh yeah. These which it's awesome. <laughs> Look at this cute little oh, clip that she had. With I should have asked her she she tape on it back. It. Oh, <laughs> I didn't think. Sorry, Debbie. I got it. <laughs> but she gifted up these. The I love those. Which I absolutely love. Yeah. I want to do these. And I saw on Instagram somebody that did them all together on one, one piece. And it, it was very cool. And yeah. I think that's what I'm going to do. Yeah with them so I, I think both of us are going to be stitching that definitely yeah so thank you again debbie yeah that was debbie so with sweet. an eye debbie with an eye and then you can go um this do you have this one yes from our friend marion marion look and, at this oh oh go ahead so it's for your flosses and there's a magnet here because i'm like oh <laughs> <laughs> and it, it pulls like pretty good so um that's really cute and then she has stitch con 2019 on the back which i really thought was a great idea it's kind of a fun fun little be a fun memory yeah thank you marion and she was um with the s'mores group yeah and i sat next to her and i got to talk to her a lot and her lns is acorns and threats Ooh. So, um, Pretty Southern had a video, and I'm like, oh, Marion's on there. <laughs> so it was kind of, it's fun to meet these people and then, like, know that you had a conversation right. with them in right. person. Yep. And so, and then right away, we got, and I, hopefully it won't, from Ryan, we got this needle minder. And Ryan is just... Adorable. And yeah, then on the so back cute. is a pattern to make this, which I have the tin. I want to make this. Really cute. And she was working it. Does it does it say in her Instagram on here at all? Um, Can you look? I right, can put my glasses on. She was working on a piece with just a hand holding a rose. And she was putting it on the back of a jean jacket. So she had waist canvas on it. And she started that, I think she started it at StitchCon. And by the end of StitchCon, I had I had walked past a room that she was in. And she's like, wait, 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 come back, come back. And she was all done. And it, it turned out really cute. And I forgot to look at her Instagram to see if there was a picture. Um, Does it have her Instagram on there? Is this Wild, Wild Violet? That's uh, her Twitter. Wild Violet Cross Stitch. This is Instagram. Instagram. I mean, yeah, Wild Violet Cross Stitch. <laughs> yeah. So go, go look and see if she's got a picture of it because it's very, very cool. It was cool. cool. Yeah. And it just reminded me back, you know, years ago we used to do waist canvas. You used to do it. Oh, you didn't do it? <laughs> I don't think I oh, ever did I that. I loved it. It was fun. And, you know, it's it's kind of cool to see it done in a modern way. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It, and it was very cool on a jean jacket. It just... Well, that's how I did my shirt that I had on the last day. <laughs> I I didn't even think about it, but I, I had bought this shirt that had... It, it, it was like cross-stitch. It was. It know, was hand it, it looked for... like it was hand-stitch. I'm sure... Uh, I don't know if it was a machine. Yeah, it looked hand stitched. It looked hand stitched. But it was all, and you could see the cross stitches all in it. But the not. I'm thinking that I was at a cross <laughs> stitch retreat wearing it. So, like, I don't know how many people are like, oh, did you make that? And the first couple I said, oh, no, I bought it. And then <laughs> I started saying, yes, yes, I did. <laughs> and then people, really? <laughs> No. no. <laughs> it was kind of fun. It was fun. Mm. So, go ahead. Okay. And then from our friend Pam from Stitching Between the Lines, this cute little Night Before Christmas needle minder. Which 
Pam collects Night Before Christmas books. And I have the one from my childhood, I think. And it reminds me a lot of these colors. I don't know if it's this one. Yeah, exactly. But I'll have to look, look to at see Christmas. Same, yeah. So that was very nice. And it was so much fun meeting you, Pam. And um, and you, it was nice um, you photobombing our video. I know. We got to talk to her a little bit. <laughs> yeah, I regret not being able to talk to her, not talking to her more. Yeah, yeah. It was it was hard with that many people right to you know you could just say hi next year it'll be different mm -hmm. yep. next year next year when we go <laughs> fingers <laughs> crossed um and then from jan hicks we got this beautiful floss i mean this is oops i have like something else embedded in it pretend that's not there this is I mean, I can imagine. And it does remind me of Jan. Yeah. Just, I can imagine how gorgeous this is, like, stitched up, stitch up with the variegation. Yeah. yeah. It, was, it was so fun to meet Jan, I think. And she gave some Hawaiian candy. Oh, yeah, but I Again, ate some of it. gone. <laughs> candy, that doesn't, that rule doesn't apply to candy. So, fun, I I just have to tell this funny story oh, about yeah. Jan Hicks. That was great. Mom, hi. <laughs> So I'm talking to my mom the Monday before StitchCon, and you know she said, "Well, are mostly local people going to be there?" And I said, "No, there are people from all over. In fact, I know one that's coming from Hawaii." And my mom, who is not a stitcher, she only watches us, so I thought, says, "Oh, you mean Jan Hicks?" <laughs> and I <laughs> cracked up laughing. I'm like, "You watch Jan Hicks?" And she said, yes, her things are just absolutely beautiful. And so I'm like, well, don't you feel like you're cheating on me by watching Jan And she's like, no, not at all. So I had to tell Jan that story. Yeah. And I got a picture with her right away on Thursday morning and sent it to my mom. So Yeah, that's funny. So, yeah, it was funny. And I told Jan the story. She just, she thought that was funny, too. So just a legend. I know, I know, Jan Hicks. And you can't say Jan. I know. It's Jan Hicks. I know. It's it's like two names. Yeah. Like you have to have it all together. Yeah. So which it's it's fun. Yeah. And she's fun too. Yeah. Oh definitely. Good so. times. Um then um we each got a card, a cute card from Belinda. Who's your stitcher on Instagram? Here's my card. And she had some patriotic love flosses. Lovely handwriting, by the um, way. There was a white here, but I've already used it. <laughs> <laughs> it was handy. I'm like, okay, I know where there's white. <laughs> no, I, I like yeah. I like these And the colors. note was so sweet. That yeah. was very, very nice. She was really nice. It was really nice to meet you, Belinda. Yeah. Oh, and then another person we got to meet... Um, Margie, oh. someone that we always comment on back and forth with on Instagram and our videos, I believe. Um, yeah, she was just so fun. And She's just funny. Really, really nice. She was there with her daughter, who, who is also a stitcher. And, so. and she brought her triplets. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I.e. the snowmen That's stitch stupid. along, Leanne and she Margie and... Um, oh, I can't think of her name. The one that's doing the Christmas stockings. Oh, Jackie? No, 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 no. Um, at StitchCon. Oh, I'm drawing a blank now. Um, I can picture your face. <laughs> and, um, she just finished hers, too. Oh, really? Yeah, so we'll have to look at it again. Yeah, and that's the, um, um, all Through the Night by Bonnie Sullivan. It's Harry, Jack, and Henry. Yeah. Um, we had a stitch along, I think starting in October or November. And Margie finished hers. And Marty, Margie fully finished hers. And they're t like tiny. Small. So they're all together. Yeah. It's so cute. Just adorable. I regret not putting mine all together now after seeing I cut hers. mine apart just because I got sick of holding all the fabric. Oh. And I did find a frame I'm going to use. So oh, maybe good. I'll finish them now. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> So, so it was fun to see that, Margie. Okay. Do you have the... Yes. Um. And then it was 
Penny yeah. came up to us and brought us this little bag from Helen D. With a cute little <laughs> note. <laughs> and we got a knot. <laughs> I love it. We commented on the knot of her, um, what, what It was she... the July uh, Prairie Schooler. She had done as pillows. As pillows. And she had the dot underneath. And and they you gotta go look at her Oh, it's amazing. At her video to see what it looks like. I think she does have one video and that might be the picture mm -hmm. of it. And she has this knot that I think her husband her yeah. husband did. Yeah. So we got knots too. So <laughs> I love it. <laughs> now I can't wait to stitch something to put that. I know. On. I'll have to think. Yeah. And then my friend Kathy and Leanne's too. Um, a long time ago, she showed this chart. Um, she had stitched it, and it was it's drawn thread the night before Christmas. And it was one of those that when she showed it hers, I was just like, oh, I have to have that. Well, she was nice enough to like. I, I don't know, she instant messaged us or whatever. Let me know, like, she saw it on Stash Unload Stash or something. Yeah. Of course, Barb, the procrastinator, kind of forgot about it. And um, so here she comes, day one, and she had gone on there and she got it for me. And she brought it. It has fabric and the thread and the chart. I mean, <laughs> how nice is that? Yeah. Like that was really, really, really nice. nice. So I'm excited to do it because it was so darn cute. I think that's really cute. And I'm going to try to do it this year. Yeah, do it. Well, yeah, start it and do yeah. it. Yeah. Do it and then so I can do it. <laughs> oh, all right. <laughs> <laughs> Always an ulterior motive. There is, yeah. Come on, Barb. Yeah, get moving. What did you say? What, what is that? Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> Here we go, Barb. Stitch. Yeah, doesn't apply to stitch. <laughs> oh, no, it doesn't. <laughs> Uh, so is that I think um, that's it yeah um, should we show what our smalls exchange oh yeah let's do that was? yeah that's a good idea mine is buried here um, so oops I saw mine was in this cute bag and I'm like that's something that I could make use of. And also this cute little sheep cookie cutter. Which is adorable. Very, very cute. And I thought, oh, that would be cute for like Stitch Easter con. time. <laughs> what does a sheep have to do with Stitch Con? <laughs> uh, and um, did I say this was from Kathleen? No. Oh, this is from Kathleen. And it's yes. just adorable. Um, oh, shoot. I'm trying to think. Little House Needlework chart, I think. She, which I thought was a really good idea. She had the um, chart, a picture of the chart pattern. So it identifies um, what chart this is. Oh, that was so, cool. But I love how she finished it. She's got like this, um, the plaid fabric, like in strips on the front. That's really cute. And then look at the back. It's that really, is really, really cute. cute. Yeah. So it's just... Adorable. It's adorable. So, yeah. thank you so much, Kathleen. Okay, and then mine. Oh shoot! I just dropped it. Okay, mine was from Kim, and I got this really cute card. When I saw the card, I'm like, okay, <laughs> that's it. I know I'm gonna like this, <laughs> and I did. It's I love that on that. I know. That's and so this cute. little jar, it's just perfect. Yeah. So I was happy to have gotten that. Yes. And there there was also a a notebook with it that I just dropped on the floor and I'm not kidding. <laughs> <laughs> and showing that. I'm sorry, Kim. But, you know, some things just don't need to be seen on camera. <laughs> <laughs> so, but yeah. I do love it, and I I think it's really adorable. Yeah. yeah. So. When you know, I have to say, like, I was really apprehensive about. Um, you were. I was, cause I'm like, I did not. I don't know. I just 
was worried about it. You yeah. had a hard time deciding what you were going to I know. I, really, I, and... I had three charts <laughs> I was picking between. One I did stitch. I can't remember what the third one was. Um, but it was just like I didn't know what to do. And... Dawn ended up getting mine and she loved it. So I was so happy that someone got it who liked it. Yeah, so. and and mine, it was kind of funny. Yeah. Because funny. Valerie, Barb, and I, we were all in the same smallest exchange. And Valerie had 15, what number did you have? Mm, like 18, 20, 18 or 18 or 20 something? I had 21. Oh, then I had 18. So you must have had 18, I had 21. And, we, and so Valerie picked my box, and which the, I did not say a word. And I knew it was Leanne's box because it had been in the car, and I knew what she had done. and Because I was teasing Leanne that I was going to pick it. <laughs> and then I, I just like <laughs> Decided that would really be cheating. Well, so. you couldn't have because Valerie was ahead of you. Oh, yeah, I couldn't have anyways, yeah. unless I would have run and like knocked it out of her hands. I don't. Not that one, Valerie. Yeah. <laughs> you don't want that one. <laughs> so then we decided to go to back to our table and open them all. And we said, well, let's open them one by one so we can see each other's things. <laughs> and so, so we're like, okay, go ahead, Valerie. And I did not say anything that it was mine at all. And she opens it and she's going on about the paper. And then she's, oh, look at this cute little card. <laughs> and then she opens it and she starts reading. And you could see her face just changed halfway through it. Yeah, it was saying, funny. This is yours. <laughs> you should have recorded her. <laughs> we should have. It was pretty funny. It was funny. So she got mine. Um, and on Instagram, both of us put our smalls on Instagram, mm -hmm. a lost and floss too, on Instagram, so you can see the pictures there yeah. Yeah. of what we did. So the one, the thing that I did was a Brenda Gervais, and I kind of almost knew it from the start that I was going to do it. I've stitched that piece a couple of times, and I really, really like it. So yeah, I think um, it just it, like the things people receive were amazing so creative and yeah really amazing and you know there weren't too many that i would say you know weren't you know they just wouldn't be your style but they were beautifully done mm -hmm. and um you know totally like, if everybody liked the same thing it'd be a boring world it would but yeah i mean this the level of stitchers there oh, yeah. was amazing. Yeah. You know, you're sitting at home, you're stitching, stitching, stitching. You have no idea what anybody else's stuff looks like. And you see pictures, and it's like, yeah, it looks really good. But mm -hmm. when see you it see in person? It, when, oh, yeah, man. that's, I think, the same thing. It's just yeah. phenomenal. So, so what are we going to do now? Whips? Stash? Yeah, what about um, the freebie table? Do you have your stuff from the uh, freebie table? I didn't. I didn't. I didn't bring that because Barb perused the freezy freebie table. I did, table. but then how many I times? Uh, three. Three. Yeah. Um, but you know, when I see some of the things people got, yeah, like, I'm like, holy cow, where was that? I didn't Why see didn't that. I, get I didn't that? see that, and I know Valerie did um, quilt books. When I went up there, I didn't see any of them. Oh, they were. I saw them. Oh, did you? I didn't see them. <laughs> So. Um, no, I, I, the majority of mine were, um, like, I'm trying to think, uh, older cross stitch magazines. Oh, and the one, um, I found, was it for that one? I found the chart for, for this, um, somebody had wanted this chart for the Sweet Land of Liberty, that bear thing, the one that I got from the trash oh or not trash but from the birth store yeah so if i did take the magazine so if somebody if you're the one that if said you're the you one it. send us a message on either the video or instagram yeah. lost and floss too yeah and um, we barb picked it up for you which was very nice of you. well i you know it was that was so fun because i must have gotten the cross stitch magazine for a couple years so it was like all the 
old issues that I <laughs> would pour over and think, oh, I'd love to stitch that. And, you know, you have a new baby and a, a toddler. It's like, oh, yeah, <laughs> probably not. Good luck. <laughs> and so, yeah, it was really fun to see things. And some have really stood this test of time. And yeah. Others not so much. <laughs> so so I brought I picked up one thing off the freebie table, and it was this Leisure Arts magazine, and I did picked it up for this pattern. In red, is that the one that has a variety of crafts in it, um, I or don't just know. cross stitch? And it shows the same in blue, but you know me. I'm it's a gonna red be red. person. <laughs> and then here they split the pattern up for different things, which oh, that's is cute. a good idea. Yeah. yeah. But I think it will be well and it will that, be red. You know. Surprise. <laughs> a red house? <laughs> surprise, surprise. You know, I was thinking about that. What? Well, when we have to have our house repainted if I do it in red. <laughs> Oh, oh, well. <laughs> oh, you meant just No, stitching. I meant stitching red houses. Yeah. <laughs> so then um, let's go. I will. Did you take a picture of the stitching that you got done at StitchCon? I have it in the same place. Oh, okay. So I, I took a picture show. because I worked on my stuff. And we thought of alternative names to StitchCon. One was Stitch Non <laughs> because no stitching. Or very little stitching got done. Mm -hmm. Or I've been hashtagging Stitch Fun because it was it, fun. it was it wasn't a con; <laughs> it was fun. Yeah, yeah. So. But no, we um, we stitched together for the first time. Mm -hmm. We have a little. We have a video. video of that. I think two back, three back, something of back. when we did it, and then our cookies are on that one oh, too. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So that was kind of fun. I can show mine. If yeah, you want me to. show show where you're at. I will have to insert a picture, <laughs> which I did take a picture of what I got done. Very very little. I don't even know which way this one goes. <laughs> so this is it. No, I stitched on other things though. Oh, you. But did. this was my my um start. For when Leanne and I stitch together. Now, is that the start that you had at StitchCon? That's what you wanted to yes. start at StitchCon? Yes. Okay. So, this is the one I started at StitchCon. And it's Prairie Schooler. Here comes Santa Claus. So I love that one. I started in the middle on his beard. And obviously, that's as far as I got. <laughs> and I'm probably not going to go back to this until I get my two Patriotics done. And because it's after Fourth of July, it is. But that's okay. Um, and then I also have three Stitch Nine challenges to finish up, and I, I don't think well one has a, enough to go on, but they're all fall related, and I want to get those done. So did you stitch on something else? Yes. Oh, do you have it? Do you, yes. Do you want me? To keep yeah, going? just show what you okay. stitched on, and then and then let's do um, whips. Okay. Well, these are whips. I know, but oh. show what you did at oh, okay. StitchCon, and then we'll... Because do you have other whips other than what you did at StitchCon? Yeah. One. Oh. Um, so I worked on Prairie School of July, and I'm getting pretty close to being done with Ooh, this. Oh, yeah. So I love this. I just I, mostly I really have like the fill, fill work on the bottom, so it's getting there. And one star to finish. Oh yeah, the star I have to ribbon. <laughs> yeah, I think I think if I stitch this one where it is, oh, I have to rip this one. Oh, and then move Just it move over it. one space, and then then I think I'll be okay with that. Um, and then the other thing I will, well, this will be a F O, so maybe I won't show oh, that until later. Okay, yeah, let's do whips. Okay, um, then the other thing I worked on was summertime by New York Dreamer and but did you did you work on this at stitch no no this is just a regular work yeah, yeah. should I stop no oh, okay no let's go so this is where I am with that I'm ready to I'm putting in the seashells I think that's what they are the white things yes. and then I'm gonna do the sand so this one 
I, I have fun stitching on it. It is fun, isn't Except it? Except I made a boo-boo, so I have, oh, I'm not supposed to say that, but I have an extra seashell. But I'm like, what's the difference, you know? There's like, seashells, there's seashells all over the place. There are. So, okay. What did you work on is at that Stitch it? Con? Is that all your wh whips? Yes. Okay. Okay, what I worked on was... Sorry, I'm not prepared here. <laughs> you okay. see the mess we have. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what I worked on uh, at StitchCon was I was filling in Prairie School Santa, Santas. So I have this that is a finish. Actually, what I got done was the sleeve and part of the coat. That's all I got done at Stitch Con. Oh, yeah, for a while it was just it was very, bad. very little. But I, I got this guy done. And then um, another whip I had. Then this I worked on at Stitch Con. And I got, this is Quaker Sewing Tray by Brenda Gervais. And I am... Stitching it on Belfast Linen Flax, 32 count. And I got, I'm pretty far. I just have like the top area to do now. So I stitched one bird and one little motif is all I got done and stitch con. But I've been working on it since. So I'm really happy. This is really a fun piece to stitch. I love the colors. I love everything about it. Can I look at it up close? Yes, up close and personal. Oh, it's pretty. It's and one over two? Yeah, one over two. And then here's the pattern. I am amazed at how much faster that mm -hmm. is. So. Oh, yeah. It's a lot different. Yeah, it's pretty. I like the colors. So then I'm just going to... Um, so now I, I am also working on autumn time. And this is Autumn Time by New York Dreamer. Let's see, there we go. I did not want to use the color that they called for for the words. So I used Sassafras. I did not like how it was too variegated for me. So, and I had from the tea in Autumn all the way down done in Sassafras. So I ripped all that out, <laughs> and it's uh, I've done it all in mulberry, and I like it better. The squirrel I, I am doing in sassafras, which is absolutely perfect mm -hmm. for the squirrel. So that I thought when I was at StitchCon I'd be ripping that out, but I didn't. I did that at home. I did that last night. Yeah, this is a pretty color. Mm -hmm. I think it. I think because it has I, some variation. That's the color I want. Yeah. It's pretty. Yeah. So, and then um, we can, so then I just wanted to show, I brought all these Santas that needed to be filled in. <laughs> <laughs> that are not done, that still need to be filled in. Well, even at home, like, I wouldn't have been able to get, even if I would have sat and stitched all those hours, I wouldn't even been able to get near done what I yeah, thought I... Yeah, that's true. You know, so... Yeah. Well, these I'm saving, like, these will be vacation things. Mm -hmm. When I go on vacation, I'm in the car, I can just fill them in. No big deal. And I think I counted, I think I have, I think I have 16 more Santas to do. Wow. Which I can't believe I have that many. It seems like you've been, like, cranking them up. It does seem like that, but I think there's 35 of them. Oh, yeah. Instead, I well, thought there were 32. How long I don't remember. Since 84, so how long is that? 35? Yeah, I thought there were 32 of them. <laughs> Plus, and I, and I have, can I, I just have mm -hmm. one finish, yeah. and then we'll go to your finishes. And this is... Prairie Schooler 2019, and I, I finished that, so. 
And that too was one of the pieces that was a fill-in piece. And I've got that done. So that's it for my stitching, Barb. Alrighty. So um, your finishes. I have one FO, Scarlet House Patriotic Scissor Pocket. And it's funny, Amy Loves Toads had this on her Instagram this morning. Oh, you're kidding. No, and she did it really cute. She did seeds on it instead of the bird. I'm like, smart woman. Oh. Because I had to rip my bird out. Because oh, I like show. that. That looks Oopsie. really good. Oh. <laughs> yeah, so I'm, I'm happy with it. I this really thing like has... I, I changed so many colors and I don't know. I had things too far over, but I like it. I so love that. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with it, but. I love the border in it. Yeah, I think it turned out cute. And now I lost my other finish. Um, <laughs> what did I do with it? Oops. Oh my. Oh my. I think I'm going to have to show it later. Well, oh, yeah. here it is. Oh. Yes, I found it. <laughs> it's it's it was almost close to being uh, FFO, but it didn't quite make it. Plus, I need approval on these fabrics. <laughs> <laughs> so, here is Summer, Lizzie Kate. That is so cute. It's just very I love happy. everything about that. Yeah, I was like kind of wondering about Pink House, but. And that is perfect. Do you like that? I love it. Okay. So this is what it's going to be. I love that. I love the fabrics. I love everything about it. Yeah. I wasn't sure because the this fabric, the very back fabric, is kind of more off-white. But, mm -hmm. you know, with the brown, I think it's fine. I think it looks really good. So. Really good. Then it's going to be glued. Next time, you'll see the final, Yay. final, final. Um, yeah, the final, that's, final. That's what I have. Um, should I do my blast from the past? Yeah, do that, and then we'll then we'll do haul. Okay. <laughs> I don't even know what year we made these. Do you, you don't have? I don't anymore. have mine anymore. Like, would that surprise you? <laughs> this is Betsy Ross, <laughs> and I hang her. We have like new old posts by our stairs, so I hang her from that. And there can't be Betsy. Oh, where he lost his hat again. Uh oh. Without Uncle Sam. <laughs> um, I gotta put his hat on. Hold, please. This hat is kind of <laughs> yellowed. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> close enough oh, to Bobby O. <laughs> pretty close. No, not enough hair. Okay, look at the little goatee. <laughs> And he's got suspenders, and <laughs> we made these, and we just thought they were the coolest things. And, we did. You know, now and I they look still at them. are cute. Yeah. So to go along with that, oh no, <laughs> these were crafted by a oh. man. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, I don't have any of those left. You don't? No. Oh. Those are um, cute. They are cute. And I hang these on the little knobs on my my uh, bifold <laughs> closet door. So their hair is a little bright. It is a little bright. Uh, and he he needs his pants attached again. I think they're... I do, I do have to say I like the fabric. I know. I used. The fabric is really cute. Yeah. And like, look at those little faces. <laughs> Whoopsie. <laughs> oh my gosh. Cute. <laughs> I think you gave these to me for my birthday. Did I but really? they they must be how old? Like twenty years at least. Oh, at least. Yeah. Yeah. Um, probably more like twenty five. Yeah, it could be. Because I always think of Jack was born twenty years ago. Oh, okay. And you were making these a long time before uh, that. Yeah. 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 So I thought that was kind of oh, fun. Oh, that's fun. Show. Thanks, Barb. Oh, um, <laughs> should I? Continue with save from the trash. Sure, let's do so that. So I found this little watering can, and I think this is just like a sticker, so I can take that off. And I'll either do, I thought it would be cute to even do like a little cross stitch thing and just paste it on I there. I think you should do like a 56 count, one over one. It would fit mm, absolutely no. perfect on there. No. <laughs> and then, so that was 62 cents. And then I found this calendar, and it's actually for next year. 
keepsakes cross stitch calendar. Oh, this was 62 year. cents as well. And so, you know, there's some of the charts that are a little too cute. Do they have the, the, well, I'll tell you. Well, chart. But look how pretty this is. Oh, that is pretty. Um, and this heart, I think, is really kind of fun. Oh, that is very cool. Like, look at that. Um, let's see what else we have there. Oh, these eggs I like, Oh, those too. are cute. Really cute? Cute. Cute. Um, that's pretty. That is cute. Watering can. So I think oh, I'll, that's fun. Oh, yeah. These I thought would be cute little summer pillows even. That's fun. Yeah. With all the bright colors. Um, this would be cute for a baby's room. It's just like a nursery thing. Um, that's like state fairish with that. Do. Um, <laughs> yeah, those are these fun. are kind of funny. I like the how they did the pendant thing. Yeah, that's a good idea. I think so too. Yeah, um, I, I like those contrasts in that pennant. And this I thought was really pretty. Oh, that's pretty. And then I forget. Oh, I I mean it's cute, but I probably wouldn't stitch that. But do they have the pen? Oh, that comes for another with it. two sixty-two cents. They were separate. Oh, that's um, funny that they're separate. Oh, I, well, I can't show this, but. So they have the picture and then the chart. The chart. So, well, I suppose like some people just want the calendar. If you're not a stitcher, mm, yeah, like, that's true. you know, they, they're cute pictures. So, yeah. um, so for 62 cents, I got like 11 chart, 12, no, 13. Baker's wow. dozen. All right. So I thought that was a great deal. I think that is a good deal. And I, I don't know. Who like, see, I never even out. find cross stitch or anything. Well, I was surprised to see this because, oh, here. They're all on the back. Keep sick. I don't even know who puts this out or where it's from. I don't either. Oh, Stevens Point. Keep sick calendar. That's hmm. in Wisconsin. It is. So, but it was my find. I was excited. So, that's it. Okay. Um, then... One more piece of business is I want to show this runner that I made for Barb. <laughs> Got these stars. Somebody asked me for the pattern, and I know I wrote back, and I said, I have it, let me look, and I'll find out the name of it. So I did, did look, but now I can't remember exactly where your comment was. So hopefully you watch. It's called Floating Star Charmer, and it's by Creekside Stitches, which is in Lodi, Wisconsin. And I think you can just look that up, look up the, the Creekside Stitches, and you can get the pattern from there. I, I use the pattern all the time. Um, you can ch change in the fabrics, totally changes the look of the pattern. So um, hopefully you're watching. Sorry, I don't remember mm, what that's it is. okay. You get lots of questions. So, so on to haul. Oh boy, it's gonna be a long one. <laughs> and we're at a, an hour already. Yeah, should we do it separately? Or do you wanna do it all together? Um, let's do it all together. Okay, all right. Okay, we're back again. Go ahead, Here Barb. we are. Should we stop and make this into two videos, Leanne? <laughs> <laughs> I first said, no, we'll just do it all in one. I've changed my mind. <laughs> Barb was right. Barb was right. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> you got that one pretty good. <laughs> I know. Um, and we decided that we're going to stop the video here, mm -hmm. and we will have a new video with our haul from StitchCon, from Keepsakes, from the Annex, and then just talking a little bit more about StitchCon and the people that we met, and um, and we'll stop that video. Mm -hmm. And then we'll do a separate video of just pictures. Yeah. So if you just want to look through the pictures and not through all the other stuff, or you want to look through the other stuff and not the pictures, 
Or if you want to look at it all, it's it'll like be in different videos. Infinite combinations. It, well, yeah. It is. <laughs> One, two, and three. One and two. One and three. Two and three. I guess not infinite. No. But you could just watch Numerous. just one, just two, just three. Or just one and two, just one and three. Just two and three. Just two and three. Six combinations. Enjoy. Because math. <laughs> so. Um, so that'll be it. So mm -hmm. we're going to stop rambling. Because it's getting dark, as you can yeah. see. Can you still <laughs> see us? Yeah. <laughs> we I, I think I'm pretty daylight. good. You're <laughs> kind of dark over there. That's all right. So, um, so we'll end it here. All right. Bye. Toodles.